Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today in this video we will talk about how to share files from your mobile to laptop without a wire or how to share large sized files from your laptop to other people. If we see daily activities, so if we if our phone is overloaded with space or if you want to share a large file, it could be a recorded session or it could be a project or it could be a software. It is very difficult because if you use traditional tools like Google Drive and all, uploading and downloading it will take a lot of time and there will be some space constraints, right? And also when you connect your mobile to laptop using USB, if in the middle if you get a call or the wire is jerks or if we have any cable issues, the copy will interrupt in the middle, right? So to avoid all these issues, what I recommend is there is one URL called gofile.io. I have been using this URL from a couple of years. It is very easy file transfer option. Also, it can be used as a storage platform. You can use this platform to store your large amount of data. Right? So, let's see this tool. So, this is the site I am talking about, gofile.io. Once you access the URL, you will see this page where you have an option called upload files. You just come here, say upload files and hit this button called add files. It asks you to find the files that you want to upload or transfer. Here we can select multiple files or we can also select uh, the large amount of file because so there is no space limit here and if you observe here the average speed of very high so within few minutes the files will be uploaded into the gofile.io location. So each file is having around 150 MB. So totally I am uploading close to 300 to 350 MB files and see the fast. It is little faster. If we see the same uploads from other applications, it will be very slow. And if you use Google Drive, that is little slow compared to this particular gofile.io. 40% completed and here you can see the remaining time you still have 1.22 minutes so the upload is completed 66 percent now and the remaining time is 55 seconds it is going fast it also depends on your uh, internet connection 80 percent completed and we still have 33 seconds We are uh, trending to end, 97% completed, we still have 5 seconds. Finally the upload is completed. Once the upload is completed, it will give us one URL. So I will just copy this URL and I will share the URL to my uh, audience. This is one way. Second way is, let's say you want to transfer the mobile files to your computer or your laptop. So, what you can do is you just open the file from your mobile or iPod. So upload all your photos, videos, everything by selecting one click and then upload them. So it generates it generates a simple URL. Access the URL from your laptop and then download it. See, I copy these files and I am going to a different browser in incognito window where I will just paste this one. So once I hit the same URL, Consider like I am an audience here. So I could see all the files that the URL is having it. And I can I if it is a video based file, I can I can directly watch it. And if I click it here, if it is a video, it will play in a video mode. Or if I just download it, I don't want to download, so it is getting downloaded. I can cancel it because it's I already have it. So if you want to play it, you can also play this one. It plays in a media player. 
right so this is the simple way we can upload the files and you can transfer the files to your friends right and now we see the other options that uh, the same go file will be provided right so as i logged in with a guest user okay i could go here and i could see my files that i uploaded these are the two files that i, I uploaded just now okay let's consider like i want to set some password so i can also set the password in order to uh, restrict my data so if i upload if i set my password one two three four five six i set when the audience trying to open this particular url from their end so i'm just opening it again it asks you to enter the password so along with the file share i also share the password so that it will be uh, not misused right so this is one option where you can use it setting the password and also let's consider like i, uh, I shared my videos to all my students right the, i got the confirmation back that all are downloaded successfully so what i can do is i will come here and immediately delete the files right so this is a good way to protect your data okay simple right the file is shared now we also see the other options so here you have the subscription right so right now i used as a free option but uh, you can also subscribe so that uh, you can get an account and you can start using it when you get an account they will be providing you many new features okay along with the file transfer so the amount is also very nominal right and also if you go here and then see other options you can see uh, apart from upload files you can also donate uh, to this particular go go file io dot organization because they are helping other people giving it for free okay and if you want to know more about this particular option you can go here and then see faq so here first question is what is the size limit there is no size limit right so they will answer here or how i can uh, set my password right or is my files are safe okay if something goes wrong can i recover it how i can recover it so they will give you all the information and in case if, if you still want to have more information you can send a mail to them they will respond back right so this is all about gofile.io it's a very simple tool start you can start using for your day-to-day -day activities now if we see if we see this third option cautions right so what i would suggest is as we are uploading our files to external share so whenever you upload your personal data personal data don't upload okay if you upload also once the other audience downloaded or once you downloaded into your laptop from mobile okay please immediately delete it that is how we can protect our data right and if you shared with other audience get the confirmation and go to them and delete it okay this way we can protect our data right so that's all friends that's all about go5.io it's a very simple tool you can start using it for your day-to-day -day activities like file share and storage your data thanks for watching like my video share my videos and subscribe my channel thank you